Once upon a time in a quaint little town, there lived a tiny fluffy dog named Oliver. Oliver was a Shih Tzu with a heart as big as his round button-like eyes. His fur was a soft blend of cream and caramel and his tail wagged with infectious joy. Despite his small stature, Oliver had an adventurous spirit that couldn't be contained. One sunny morning, Oliver woke up to the chirping of birds outside his cozy doggy bed. He stretched his legs, yawned, and decided that today was the day for a grand adventure. With a determined gleam in his eyes, he scampered out of the front door and into the world beyond. As Oliver trotted through the town, he encountered all sorts of new and exciting things. He sniffed the flowers in the park, chased butterflies, and even made friends with a wise old cat named Whiskers who shared tales of far-off lands. Oliver's small size allowed him to squeeze into hidden nooks and crannies, discovering secret corners of the town that nobody else knew about. As he explored, Oliver stumbled upon a bustling marketplace where people were selling all kinds of delicious treats. The scent of freshly baked cookies wafted through the air, and Oliver couldn't resist following his nose. He befriended a kind baker who, charmed by Oliver's cuteness, gifted him a bag full of assorted goodies. Oliver's tail wagged furiously as he pranced away, proudly carrying his treasure. Just as Oliver was about to head back home, he heard a faint cry for help. Following the sound, he discovered a group of ducklings stuck in a pond, unable to climb up the slippery banks. Without hesitation, Oliver leaped into action. His small size allowed him to navigate the water easily, and with his gentle mouth, he carefully carried each little duckling to safety, earning grateful quacks in return. Word of Oliver's bravery spread throughout the town. And soon, he became a local hero. The townspeople celebrated him with a special ceremony, and the mayor even declared a day in his honor. Oliver, with a crown made of flowers on his head, basked in the adoration of the community. From that day forward, Oliver continued to explore and bring joy to everyone he met. His small size didn't limit his big heart, and he proved that even the tiniest creatures could make a significant impact on the world around them. And so, in the little town where Oliver lived, every dog, big or small, aspired to be as brave and kind as the small dog with the fluffy fur and the giant heart named Oliver. As the seasons changed, Oliver's fame continued to grow. He became a beloved figure in the town, and children would gather around to hear stories of his daring escapades. Every afternoon, Oliver could be found at the local park, where he had unofficially taken on the role of the town's playmate for the children. One chilly autumn day. As the leaves crunched beneath his paws, Oliver noticed a lonely-looking girl sitting on a bench. Her name was Lily, and she had just moved to town. Lily had a shy smile, and her eyes sparkled with a mix of curiosity and uncertainty. Oliver, sensing her need for a friend, approached her with a wagging tail and a warm gaze. From that day on, Oliver and Lily became inseparable. They explored the town together, discovering hidden treasures and creating new adventures. Oliver taught Lily the joy of finding joy in the little things like chasing leaves in the park or watching the sunset from their favorite hill. But as winter approached, a problem arose. Lily's family couldn't afford a proper winter coat for her, and the town was about to experience a cold snap. Oliver, being the resourceful little dog that he was, hatched a plan. 
with the help of the townspeople, he organized a winter clothing drive, gathering coats, scarves, and mittens for those in need. He of the drive arrived, and the townspeople, inspired by Oliver's compassion, donated generously. Lily's eyes widened with surprise and gratitude as she received a warm winter coat and accessories that would keep her snug throughout Oliver with a proud wag of his tail, knew that he had made a difference not just for Lily but for the whole town. The following spring, the townspeople decided to honor Oliver once again. This time, by unveiling a small statue of him in the park. It depicted Oliver with a duckling in his mouth, capturing the moment that had endeared him to the inscription read, Oliver, the small dog with the big heart. And so, the story of Oliver, the brave and kind-hearted Shih Tzu, became a cherished legend in the town. Every generation passed down the tale of the little dog who showed them that even the smallest among them could make the world a better place. Oliver continued to live a happy life, surrounded by friends and filled with the love of a town that would forever be grateful for the warmth he brought to their hearts.